I already hired him for you. Um, all right, so this is BD Live. Uh, right now we have a uh, the menu system for Godzilla. As you can see at the bottom, your normal buttons, play, language, scene selection. But in the upper left-hand corner, there is a BD Live button. I can go ahead and click on that. And now what happens is your BD movie that's inside of your Blu-ray player will go ahead and connect uh, using the internet to the server over at Sony Pictures. And well, Disney will have this, so it's one such as Fox and uh, Warner Brothers. Um, so you'll now be able to get uh, exclusive content, additional content for that title, and uh, that'll be streamed right to your player. So here we are. So we're now we're connected to the BD Live from the Godzilla page. We have. Uh, the ability to go ahead and get a free ringtone. Set to your phone if you want to. Or you can even download uh, previews of current uh, Blu-ray titles or of upcoming Sony pictures. Right. Uh, and another really cool feature of BD Live is that the ability, if you look right underneath it, it says go to the cross media bar to download a bonus portable copy. Um, that. That particular Blu-ray disc and uh, many other Sony Blu-ray discs to follow with BD Live will go ahead and allow you to go ahead and not only have a full HD version of uh, Godzilla on the Blu-ray disc, but also have a one gig version that will go ahead and download to your PSP, so wow. you can take Godzilla on the go with you as well. Excellent. Yeah, so, I've watched quite, watch quite a few movies on my on my PSP in my time. Yeah. So, so now, so now you not only have the Blu-ray version, but you also got a portable mm -hmm. version of the film. Right. And uh, you'll definitely see more titles to so, come. So this is that. this is Blu-ray 2.0, right? And Blu -ray when is it going to be available for the general public? Uh, we're looking uh, late, later this year in 08, uh, possibly around summertime. But the first 2.0 title will actually be out later this month from Lionsgate. Okay. So uh, it, it might be here sooner than we think. Excellent. And how much cost is going to add to the average uh, Blu-ray player? Is it going to be that much more expensive? Uh, you know, I actually don't think so. Like, for example, the PS3, um, prices shouldn't change on that. And the PS3 uh, should be able to do uh, a BD Live later on this year as well. And uh -huh. we'll have players out from Sony as well, standalone players that do uh, BD Live. And uh, there shouldn't be any delta on them. Are you going to be able to upgrade your PlayStation 3 to the new version or not? Very, very, very possible. We're not really uh, saying when that might happen, but um, I definitely uh, would anticipate seeing something like that. Uh -huh. So uh, all these are uh, uh, Blu-ray 2.0 players, are they? Absolutely. We have our uh, PS3 there that we're running the demos on. And then we'll show two prototype units that will be out later this year that will be be live. Excellent. Thanks a lot for your time there. Uh, Robert, John Gatt from TK Arena. I got it. Uh, we'll talk to you next time, guys. Thank Thanks you very much. Bye-bye.